how did we ever measure the mass of Earth? And how do we know the mass of the Sun? We've never been there. How do we know the mass of the Moon or Jupiter or Pluto? It's not like you can put them on a balance and measure the mass directly. Let's learn physics. Imagine you're standing on the Earth, because you probably are. You know that the weight equation is mass times the gravitational field strength, and you can actually measure that gravitational field strength or the gravitational acceleration. And you know also that the Earth is pulling down on you, and so the universal law of gravitation by Newton also applies. Weight is gravitational force, so you can put those two equations together, and on the right-hand side, there are two M's, so you make one little M that's U and one the big M that's Earth. And if you have the radius of Earth, and you can measure the gravitational field strength, and you have the gravitational constant, you can calculate the mass of the planet on which you're standing. Now, Newton came up with his law of universal gravitation just before 1700, but he didn't know that gravitational constant until Cavendish came along and was able to calculate that around 1800. So it's been 200 years we've known enough information to calculate the mass of Earth. You're not on the surface of the planet, but you want to find the mass of the planet anyway? Use a satellite. Use a telescope and find all the distances that you need and the time that it takes to go around for that particular satellite. And by 1800, once we had that gravitational constant by Cavendish, and we had observed a lot using the telescope, we could then solve the problem. Gravitational force is the centripetal force that keeps it in orbit. So set the two equations equal to each other. Little mass cancels out, one of the radii cancels out, and you get the equation. The mass of the planet is the radius of the satellite orbit times the tangential speed squared of the satellite orbit divided by that special gravitational constant discovered by Cavendish. Satellite's moving in basically a circle, so it's just tangential speed of circumference over time. That equation is more commonly the tangential speed of a satellite equation, the square root of the quantity gravitational constant multiplied by the mass of the central object divided by the radius of orbit. So yeah, you can look in a chart and find the mass of the sun and the mass of the earth and the mass of the moon and the mass of all the planets, but you can pretend you don't have it. And if you're standing on the planet, you can measure the gravitational field strength, you can calculate the mass of that central object using that equation. Or if you're looking at a satellite, then you can use this equation. It's kind of cool. You can find the mass of all the different objects in our solar system.